So a really quick video here. Uh, this is a little UART type interface which I bought some time ago for flashing uh, AVR microcontrollers and I managed to blow it up. This little chip here is a 3.3 volt regulator and one of my DuPont connectors came off and slipped onto a neighboring pin on here. They're very loose sometimes and caused a short from 3.3 volts to ground. Uh, which fried this little voltage regulator and clearly has no um, current limiting. So I thought I'd do a quick video on how to replace one of these, even if you don't have um, a hot air soldering station or anything like that. Because these little components are actually not too hard to do just with a soldering iron. So I'm going to apply a little solder and heat up this part. Get all three pins and it will hopefully yep come off like that now i can clean up the pads i have no solder braid at the moment so i'm just going to just try and flick off as much as i can and i have a replacement here which i shall drop upside down and just try and nudge into place. I shall put my soldering iron down while I do this. Stubborn thing. Sometimes easier to move the board around than the part. Oopsie. Yeah. Right, I'm just going to use the soldering iron to tack down the pin here, like so. It's reasonably straight. And now I should be able to reflow both of these other two pins together. Kind of at the limit of my soldering iron's reach here, so. It's a little a bit of a struggle to get this under the camera. I'm going to just apply a generous amount of solder there and hopefully the chip will sit down. Nicely like that. And that should be it. I shall plug it in and test it now and I will let you know in the comments if it worked. Now I couldn't do that to you, I shall plug it in and see if it works. Let's have a look. There's a light and if I go up onto the computer I should be able to run message which is a command to show the system log on Ubuntu and there we go it's been detected so that's great working board hopefully we could do some tests now but it looks like it's probably just that that was broken and lastly uh, here's just a, a little look at the guilty party here well the guilty party being me for accidentally blowing it up really but this is the uh, the original 3.3 volt regulator, which is now just rubbish, but very tiny rubbish. So that's it. Uh, just a short one, as always. If you like the video, please do like and subscribe. And uh, if you want to see more things like this, then do comment below and let me know what you'd like to see. Thanks very much. Thanks for watching and see you next time.